who's coming here, uh, not necessarily trying to, to go after us, but maybe being satisfied with just a point and, and getting a tie. So uh, it's tough to break down sometimes, but I think we found ways to uh, get chances, and, and uh, the good part of that is we've been able to find some goals. Thank you, Jason. No problem. Does this make a statement in your first game without you? Well, I think uh, when people look around the league, look at our team, it, it looks almost like a one-man show at times. Uh, you know, and I, I don't think that's a discredit to us as a team. I think that's more just credit to Wando stepping up to the plate week in, week out, and either getting a goal or getting an assist. I mean, you can't deny what he's done. So, um, you know, for for us to not have him, uh, who's an important piece, and Ryan Johnson, who's another important piece, uh, to go against a tough Houston team who was, uh, you know, really up to the task tonight and get a get a result, I think it says a lot about. Um, the first guy all the way to the last guy in our lineup. And I, I thought it was a great uh, team effort uh, from everyone. Can you talk more about that team effort, especially late in the second half, protecting a one-goal lead? You, know, you guys have been giving up late goals in the games of late. What was the difference tonight? Particularly. Yeah, I think uh, it was... It was very good to see that guys being able to uh, come in the lineup and out the lineup without a, without a hitch. And I thought Bobby Burling stepped in and did a great job. Um, Ampai started tonight and did a great job for us. And I think, uh, you know, we're, we're getting to see uh, the actual depth and, and guys, you know, ability to play. Uh, Beta Shaw had a great assist on the first goal. I mean, guys are stepping up uh, when they're called upon. And I think that's the sign of a good team. And um, being able to really hold on to that lead and, and close Houston out is huge. Uh, I think. Some some instances we might you know give up a goal and then it becomes a tie and then we're scrapping just to get away with a point. To close them out was a, was a good sign. Talk about uh, maybe you were asked, but 84th minute you had a, a nice you headed a ball away that um, that Cam I think Cam probably thought he had a goal right there, tying goal. Yeah, I think uh, you know obviously playing against those two strikers tonight it's a huge uh, huge disadvantage for me in the size department and I think the one thing that I you know that I have that's an advantageous to me is um, I read the game pretty well and I put myself in good spots and you know I, I may not be able to jump over those guys a lot of the time but um, that was a, a scenario where I, th I was in a good spot and I was able to make a, a last-ditch effort play and it might have saved a goal for us so um, those are the kind of things that uh, you know I pride myself on and I was very happy that I could make that play for my team. What changed for you guys at halftime? 